Today, we will talk about cross-selling. Cross-selling is the practice of marketing additional products to existing customers, often practiced in the financial services industry. For example, a bank client with a mortgage may be encouraged to also purchase a personal line of credit or a savings product like a CD. Financial advisors can often earn additional revenue by cross-selling additional products and services to their existing client base. However, care needs to be taken to do this correctly in order to stay clear of regulators and protect the client's best interests. Advisors who cross-sell financial products or services need to be thoroughly familiar with the products that they are selling. It is important to understand how and when the additional product or service fits into their client's financial picture so that they can make a more effective referral and stay compliant with suitability standards. Cross-selling in the financial services industry has had its share of successes and failures, with companies such as Wells Fargo and HNR Block experiencing varying degrees of success with their cross-selling strategies. Cross-selling is the practice of marketing additional products to existing customers, while upselling is the practice of persuading customers to purchase an upgraded or more expensive version of a product or service. Cross-selling can increase revenues and customer loyalty, but it can also have adverse effects if done incorrectly. It is important to understand consumer behaviors and needs and how complementary products fulfill those needs and add value. The Wells Fargo cross-selling scandal is a real-world example of how cross-selling can go wrong, resulting in financial penalties, customer refunds, and damage to the company's reputation. Consider using an email drip campaign to periodically introduce complementary products and services, and wait until you have developed a relationship and have proven success with the customer. Do focus on satisfied customers and promote additional products to them, and don't aggressively push related products or attempt to sell without understanding the customer's need for it. Cross-selling is a valid and ethical business practice to bring in more business. It's simply good business practice to discuss winter coat sales with a sporting enthusiast who is out shopping for new skis. eBay features a cross-promotion connections program whereby eBay sellers can connect with each other. Here are four key takeaways. 1. Cross-selling is the practice of marketing additional products to existing customers, often practiced in the financial services industry. 2. Financial advisors can often earn additional revenue by cross-selling additional products and services to their existing client base. 3. Care needs to be taken to do this correctly in order to stay clear of regulators and protect the client's best interests. Advisors who simply make referrals in order to receive additional incentives may find themselves on the receiving end of customer complaints and disciplinary action. 4. Wells Fargo was fined more than $185 million and refunded more than $2.8 million to customers for its cross-selling scandal. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.